Yo, what's going on guys? It's Eduardo here. I'm going to show you guys how to make a clean Valorant montage the proper way. I just had a voice crack. We don't talk about it, okay guys? Okay, first thing, first things first, I'm going to show, show you what it's going to look like. Right here, top right. Okay, it's a zoom in, brightness, and gloss and blur. That is key. It makes your montage look so much better, so much like... It just looks so nice. It looks better than just killing them and not doing anything. I learned that the hard way. My montages were like that, but now I know. Okay, guys. Look at that clean smoothness of a kill. Okay. Okay. First thing you gotta do is get your clip. This is me flanking on blind. Bind. We just gotta find the right moment. Okay, right here I'm pretty sure I get a kill. So, yeah. I want to drag the clip right here. Okay. That's when I get the kill, guys. So, what I want to do next is... Get it? That guy's reaction time is so late. It's so sad. <laughs> okay. So, look. Right when the glitch shoots... Oh, God. I, I, we, don't, we don't talk about it. So, basically... Oh, my God. This hurts my ears. Okay. One clip, he's dead, okay? I want to go back one. Okay, so it's one, two, three, okay? I want to go three back. I want to click on his. Effects and replay. Okay, let's just add these th these things. We're going to go to blur, gloss and blur. Color, saturation, and brightness. Okay, we added those, okay? I'm going to show you guys how to do the zoom out effect. Okay, first things first. Why is this blur on? So bad. Okay, so we're gonna click this keyframe for scale, and we're gonna. So it's already keyframe right there. It's a great thing. One, two, three. He's dead. Okay, we're gonna just turn it up to like one twenty, one thirty, and then after he dies, like his body drops, we're gonna put it back. It's gonna go back to normal, so it's a hundred. And boom, let me show you how that looks. One enemy. It just zooms out. It looks so nice, so good, okay? One so let's just go back to where he dies. One, two, three. Now, I'm gonna show you guys how to make it way faster. It's gonna be way better, okay? Personally, make your saturation go up. It just makes the game look more vibrant, more nice for the viewer. So now, this is how you do it way faster, like, okay, we're gonna go keyframe for sigma, and keyframe for brightness. Now, once we do that, we are going to wanna, one, two, three, he's dead, and we're gonna go sigma, three, don't make it too harsh or three things and it looks super ugly. Put it to 120, one, two, three. Or when he just drops down, I'll try to match it up right there. Now sigma back to uh, zero, and brightness all the way to uh, a 100. Okay. Now let's replay it. One enemy. You guys saw that? It's a slight, like it's so slight, but it looks so nice. Enemy okay. Now. I'm gonna show you how to do it the good way. Not the good way, but. Damn, look at that headshot. One, okay. One, two, three. Same thing for this one. We're gonna add a keyframe. Oh, I don't know what I did. <laughs> it's more right here. There it is. Keyframe there. And then keyframe on Sigma. And keyframe on brightness there now that we did that one, two three he's dead there now let's put the scale up to 130 sigma to like three three yeah three is nice and the brightness to 120 and now we did that now that he's turning away now that my character's turning away i want to Bounce it back to 100, 
sigma down and brightness to a 100 okay now let's rewatch this first clip boom dead next clip dead right here see dang that that looked nice oh my yeah dang okay okay nice. and then that that's the best way to edit and now just add your music make it go on beat and then best montage ever for valorant and um hope you guys enjoyed the video i'm gonna start uploading more i promise you that but i do have school and yeah guys thank you for watching peace out subscribe and like the video and bye